which is inside Liverpool, Fulham turned down a fresh offer from West Ham United, who are looking to replace Declan Rice for the potential Reds target. If Liverpool enter the transfer market for Fulham's Joao Palinha, they would be doing so with competition from Premier League rivals West Ham. The UEFA Europa Conference League winners announced the sale of Declan Rice on Saturday, doing so even before Arsenal in what appeared to be a slag league at the time. It took the Gunners to get a deal completed. As a result, they now have an extra £105 million to play with during the current window. Paulinho has previously been tipped to be David Moyes' primary target and now there appears to be confirmation of that fact in the form of a £45 million bid table and swiftly rejected by full help this afternoon. The Cotagers only signed the Portuguese pivot 12 months ago upon their latest return to the Premier League for a reported fee of £20 million, though a successful maiden campaign has only served to spark a fresh round of interest. Alongside reports of the bid, however, Sky Sports News claim that Palinha's current club are discouraging offers for their men slapping an eye-watering £80 million price tag on their men. This sends a message not only to West Ham, but to the rest of the top flag and Liverpool in particular. It tells ongoing to facilities Fabinho's exit to Saudi Arabia after a prosperous five years on Mercy's side. They too will be in the market for a defensive midfielder. But with the latest update hinting at the level of money Anfield chips will have to part with to sign Palinha, it throws into doubt the hope of business being done with Fulham. To put it into perspective, Chelsea are expected to complete the sign of a 21 years old Moises Caicedo for £80 million, with Jude Bellingham completed his switch to Real Madrid last month for an initial £88.5 million. It is an increasingly difficult market that Liverpool are about to enter, and one where decision making will be vital.